Hey everybody, how are you doing today? We are on Half Moon Key. This is Carnival Corpse Private Island, also known as Little San Salvador. And we have arrived here on Holland America's new Stottendam. It's a brand new ship. And we've been here before, but this time we're gonna show you a, a little secret snorkel place we found and maybe show you some other activities that you can do here on the island to stay active. When you first arrive to the island, you will pull in way back there. That's the main part of the beach where a lot of people spend their time, their days. There's a lot of uh, restaurants and activities nearby, you can see. You can rent snorkel equipment and things like that, which we have done, but we're gonna head to a different part away from all the crowds. Half Moon Key gets its name from its moon shape or crescent shape. And we're going way out to the point out there to snorkel. As you can see, we've not walked too far. And you get to the private cabana areas, there's lots of loungers. But the crowds start thinning out dramatically. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Almost. Colleen guesses it's about a half mile or more to walk all the way down the beach. Look at the sand. It is so soft. We were last here about eight years ago and we were walking this way. A couple came by and told us to keep going because they had found a cool spot to snorkel at. And so now it's become one of our favorite spots in the Caribbean. Kind of cool that your ship is always in view. Look at that blue water. Get some great photos of your cruise ship. Mostly Holland America ships come here, but occasionally a few others in the Carnival family. This is known as Holland America's private island, really. We're almost there, just ahead. Got a little bit of a private beach. We're gonna gear up and get in the water. It's so nice and wild and serene down here. I love it. We're gonna go as far as we can and then change, get in the water because we gotta swim out past two points to the right out there. So we're gonna cut down our swim as much as possible. We found a little shaded area to get changed, so don't look. All right, we're all set. Let's go see what we can find. We're heading in. The water feels pretty nice. Especially for the last day of January. So we've come out quite a distance from uh, our starting point and we were going to go a little farther but it looks like the it's getting a little shallow and rocky over here and we don't trust the currents 
out that far into the sea area. So see there's a nice little private beach here so you could pull up and relax and spend a little time. Uh, the currents are coming at you pretty good so it's going to be harder to swim back. So this is a nice snorkel but I suggest you be very confident snorkeler and swimmer before you try it. Well, we made it back safely. Now we're gonna take a couple hours to relax and recover and see what other activities we can enjoy in the afternoon on the island. <laughs> it's relaxation time. We just had some lunch at the island barbecue and we've rented these clamshell enclosures on the beach. We're gonna get in some rest and then go for a run. Yes, a run. I'll show you that in a minute. Parallel to the beach area is a paved road. That's a good pathway for jogging. We're gonna do about a mile or so, get warmed up so we can get back in the water. Getting around Half Moon Key all different ways today. You saw we were swimming, doing some snorkeling. We took a little run, and now we're going by horseback. Yes, they have stables here on the island, and you can go riding. 